Okay, so this is another game, but this isn't live, obviously, you can tell. And I'm going to show you, this is a game that I played, like, the very next game I played since the last one that you saw, that average game. This is a lot like me. This is the type of game that I play, and this is how I play, and I'm very proud of this one because it's mostly legit kills, in my opinion. Doesn't mean that, you know, blind fire kill isn't legit or a melee kill, but, you know, but whatever. Uh, here we go. Enjoy, I suppose. This guy's gonna need to kill. Yep. Thing here, and then this guy. Pretty easy kill. I don't know why, why you would do that. You can't even get a pull down from there. Oh, I did get two pull downs in this game. Two idiots that didn't know what the hell they were doing, apparently. And since I have the Monkey Man booster, it, to upgrade to gold. Oh, that one actually got him to kill, and then I died. Here, like, it wouldn't load. He wouldn't load. I don't understand. That's the problem with the t bolt It takes too long to reload. But the thing is that I hate is that when you reload, you can't roll. You can only jump, run, and hide. And spin. That's it. You can't roll, you throw grenades, you shoot your weapons, you, you, it, there's just so many things that happen that, that prevent you from reloading. But whatever. But I have that booster, the Monkey Man booster. And to upgrade it to gold, you have to get like 25 pull downs or something like that. And in this game, if, if you play Uncharted 2, they are significantly harder to get the pull downs. If you remember Uncharted 2, like the way the pulldowns are in this game is the way the pulldowns should have been a long time ago. You know, in Uncharted 2. They're really hard to get. You have to be right next to the guy to get it. And that's the way he should have been in, in the beginning. That guy had good cover, so. He has revenge, but at least he's not, he was aiming, so. It's all good with that guy. You remember in Uncharted 2, you could be hanging off a ledge. And. If the other guy on the ledge is like 20 feet away, you still can pull him down, which is kind of stupid. You know, it shouldn't work like that. You know, the guy on the ledge should have the advantage. And I'm trying to tell you, the guy hanging from the ledge had the advantage. It was completely stupid. Uh, they kind of fixed it towards the end. Oh, here's where I got my two pull down. At the end, it became more of a 50-50 thing. Who's ever there wins. Whoever like presses on guess on time or whatever wins. In this game, kicking off is obviously you you have significant advantage when you're standing on the ledge, not hanging. Again, that's the way it should be. So here I have my thing. I thought someone was shooting. This guy got lucky. We we traded shots though. Yeah, so right here I was like, what the hell do I do? What the hell do I do? Recharge, recharge. Uh, oh no, we didn't trade kills. Okay, never mind. I got him. My friend, I got the streak. I don't remember that. Oh, here, this is the worst. I try and jump from there to there, and he. Oh no, okay, that's not it. Here's where we trade kills then. Okay. And they gotta fix some of the, like, the ledge things, like sometimes you jump off the ledge and you're trying to hang off to something like there and it doesn't hang on. Oh, is, and you end up dying as a result, like if you play high rise, if you jump at an angle to a to, like, you know, a hanging thing or a climbable thing, you're gonna fall and die. And I hate that. Oh, and the storm wasn't during this point. Yeah, I was running there because I was like about to die. So I was like running like a little pussy girl. <laughs> um, and then right here, I was like about to die again. So I was like, shit. But they took care of the guy, so it's all good. Where am I? Right there, 
we almost traded kills, and then the guy behind him, he got killed with the diesel. And here you'll see my emblem. Oh yeah, uh, this is when the, um, the, the sandstorm came in, that's why you hear it right now. So right here I'm running, and I, there's someone right there, I just don't see him. Right behind me, there's someone. Oh, right there, you, you kind of saw him in the corner. Right there, you saw him right there. Yeah. I guess it's random when you do it. Or there you can kind of slam them in the back. That's my animal. Nothing special. <laughs> special. It's just a bare claw. That's all it is. Nothing really stupid. Way behind. Wipe them out. I don't know what the hell is doing there. I think I might have fucked him up. Right here, I get the jump right. Yeah, I'm gonna throw grenades, see what happens. Oh, right there, now my emblems, you can see it. There it is. On the wall. Just the bear call with the silence here. That's all it is, nothing special. The guy. And this is actually a pretty good part right here. Now they're concentrating on some other guy. Right here, oh my god, I almost died there. And then he throws a grenade and somehow I don't die. And once again, I almost died. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't die there. He shot me a shit ton of times. This game, yeah, I'm sure it's been very inconsistent. Like sometimes you kill someone, sometimes you don't. And there's someone else in the middle. Someone else is going to win. I thought someone else is in the middle. But anyways, this is the this is a much more typical game for me. Where am I? 14 and 7, you can't. That's it. 14 and 7 with 4 assists. That's a much more typical game for me. Not that 1 and 12 shit you that you that you that you see. That was so terrible. Oh my god. The sad part is that I was actually trying. <laughs>